little uh, dumpstering documentation. Yeah. Uh, this is a riot find. Yeah, this is Josh for you. Um, I can tell you what you need to go dumpstering. Here are the essentials. A pair of gloves. A working flashlight. And uh, dumpster shoes. We just got out of the car, and here's Josh, and here's our dumpster. Let's see what we can find. All right. Ooh. Doesn't Ooh, look like is. much at the moment, but if you peek around, we got carrot, unopened, unopened, clean. We got lots onions, of carrots, nice. lots of carrots. Looks like cucumbers, some squash. That might be squash, but that's okay. Some mangoes even. Ooh, strawberry. Yeah. Back there we got more onions. Oh, so much good stuff. And we'll show you kind of what the end result looks like in a little bit. Josh is now in the dumpster. Um, I wanted to point out one common misconception of dumpster diving is that you need to get in the dumpster. Um, you don't have to do this, what Josh is doing, but uh, if you choose to, you can kind of get a lot more goodies. Um, you can only ever reach so far oh into the dumpster, God. but look at that perfect cantaloupe. Little bruise maybe, but it'll be fine. So, um, but yeah, Josh is a daredevil. He brought his dumpster and shoes, and he's just getting right in. All right, after dumpster site site number one, this is the uh, Di Dollar General Market on Nolansville. We have an entire light unopened box of black cereal. Nice. Hot dog buns, green peppers. Cucumbers, broccoli, bags of onions, honeydew melon, strawberries, bags of carrots, some cheese. Now, some people might not be daring to take the cheese, but we're we go all out. <laughs> um, what do we got? Another one? Uh, yeah, homemade tomato sauce. We've got what eight, nine, nine jars of it, and another bag of onions. Now those jars, you know, dollar each at you know your basic grocery store or Aldi's or whatever. Completely um, unopened. Completely, completely unopened. The reason, the reason they were in there was because there was in probably the case that they were shipped in a, a jar broke, and uh, got tomato sauce everywhere. So these were all in just because they were a little dirty. All right, that's it. Next stop, um, Aldi's. We'll see. We are in the back of Food Lion, another dumpster. Um, Josh, what do we got here? Are those peanuts? Yeah, yeah. Peanuts. Oh my goodness. We got blueberries in here. Sorry, I'm blocking the light. Blueberries. Yeah, I got a lot of produce here. Produce? Good. All right, let's, we'll show you what we get. This is Josh making his entry into the dumpster. <laughs> no shame. <laughs> There's a lot in here. Yeah. Every once in a while, um, when dumpstering, you come across a mystery dumpster item. That is one of the um, individually wrapped packages that were in a bigger package. So this is from, this is a Mrs. Fields package. Josh is going to find out what's in it. And the rule is he has to eat it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Ooh, cookie, chocolate chip, gooey. All right, we're going to enjoy. See <laughs> what do you find? Oh my goodness. Two inch LTD. Flat screen. Nice. We're gonna be rocking it at the cuddle then. <laughs> All right, here we are behind Dollar General and some other stores. Um, two pretty empty uh, bins. Why are we just chilling, hanging out here, Josh? Because there is a uh, truck unloading a load of fresh groceries at Aldi. <laughs> nice. Off the street here. <laughs> And why do we not want to go and dumpster when a truck is unloading, Josh? Well, usually it doesn't make that big of a difference because it seals off. The problem is that when the truck loader gets done loading and uh, comes out to where the truck and finds you calling in the dumpster. Can anybody say, I like strawberries? 
Well, look Ooh, at that. Ooh, I like strawberries. And whether you put them in smoothies or dehydrate them or eat them fresh, that is a heck of a lot of strawberries, and I guarantee you all of them are not bad. dumpster bothers you, you could uh, find some innovative ways to use stuff from the dumpster, like clothespins, clothes, collar, uh, block your house. And then you start talking like that. <laughs> oh. Sometimes, just try. Uh, alright.